the independent coffee scene is massive. It's yeah. getting bigger, mm -hmm. uh, and I think I've noticed the last sort of two years mm -hmm. that more and more people are moving away, realizing that you know the big chains they good. do something for them. Yeah, mm -hmm. but. People have got to get them to understand things a little bit more, not only from quality, but also the fact we should be supporting local. So it's, yeah. it's already sort of happening there, yeah. but it's more of an underground way. Mm -hmm. um, you know, the own roasters generally don't brand. Mm -hmm. What they generally do is say our coffee's really good, yeah. and that's it, mm -hmm. and, and it is. Um, but we're putting a whole brand behind it, so there's a, an association that, you know, we can find it there, we can find it yeah. there, we're promoting it online. Take the tea and coffee market, there's no local no. real brand mm -hmm. that's doing what we are trying to do. Mm -hmm. And I do think that um, you know if I can put, it, put this out there, it'll be a commercial business, don't get me wrong, but it can be commercial and it can also give back. So there's a win-win out of it, and, and I just think it's a no-brainer. There are so many charities out there now. Yeah. Um, obviously, we love Manchester. Um, it was Mayor's charity. The whole idea of it being worker B, it's all about the community, mm -hmm. it's all about pulling together for Manchester. Mm -hmm. You can't more pulling together than the Lord Mayor. We've got the town hall there, you know, Queen B. Yeah, yeah. It, it all tied in. Mm -hmm. uh, and also, the bigger picture of what they do. There's not much in Manchester they don't cover. Mm -hmm. um, they've obviously got a big outreach there as well. Mm -hmm. So, you know. Is it the biggest and the best? I don't know. Yeah. Forever Manchester's going a slightly different direction um, and, and we like the concepts of what we're doing. Mm -hmm. uh, so that was the main reason. So you've got the big guys and you've got a little bit of the, but the fact is 100% of that money's going to stay local. But I do think that we, we have got something there that people will want to get involved in.